In this video, I am presenting more historical footage of Master Guo Ning's legacy from the old Porta Square days. This footage comes from my older Kung Fu brother, Bing Gong's collection. Some of the material has already been presented way back in the past, the demonstration of Cha Chuan and Monkey by Sifu. But now that I have a much better editing system, I am presenting it in its full context as I received it from Bing. Dawson Lee's grand opening was one of the first recorded major events to happen in the early days. The year was 1966, one year before I started. His photo was taken at the grand opening of his studio down in Palo Alto, which is in the Bay Area Peninsula, south of San Francisco. It appears that Sifu Guo's reputation was well known, looking at the assortment of well-known masters in the photo. Master Guo is sitting in the center and to his left is his wife Simone. And to his right is Dawson Lee, one of the first students that Guo granted permission to teach and also act as one of our mentors in the early days. To Dawson Lee's right is YC Wong who had a studio across the street from Sifu a well-known Hungar and Bakwa master that also studied with Sifu for some time. And this is Master Brendan Lai and his wife to the right in the photo. Brendan Lai was a northern praying mantis master and also had a studio on Mission Street where he sold martial arts equipment. And right behind Sifu and Simu is Bing Gong, Sifu's top disciple and my older Kung Fu brother. And to Bing's left is Marilyn Cooper holding Sifu and Simu's baby boy, Chung Mei. I'm sure there are other well-known masters in the photo, but the ones I name are the only ones I knew and recognize. And here is Dawson Lee demonstrating a few moves out of Guo Ning's original Tai Chi form. And this is Master Guo Ling Ying performing Cha Chuan, the second form of his Northern Shaolin. The stage is pretty small so the form is slightly abbreviated. In this demonstration, at this uh, point, Sifu is 71 years old. It's interesting to note that he decided to perform Cha Chuan, which shows how much he loved his uh, Shaolin, even as he got older. Again, some of the moves are abbreviated because of the small space. And then I love how he could fit it onto the stage and still keep the flavor of the northern set. And in this demonstration, he is performing monkey. Sifu was fairly mischievous in his nature, and so it was a very appropriate form for him. He rarely performed this, and there's only one student that he taught it to. My younger Kung Fu brother, Robert Bergman, was the only one to learn this form. And this is Simone Kuo with her newly born baby boy, Jung Mei. When I started studying in 1967, he was still crawling around on the studio floor. And of course, we called her Simu, which is the wife of your Sifu. Judging from the amount of people, it's a fairly big opening. Another great footage from the old days. 
Please subscribe if you want to be notified of more great footage like this in the future.